good morning guys happy monday welcome back to a new weekly vlog i am on i didn't train this morning because i went to the physio on saturday about a pain in my quad in my left quad just above my knee and i have a slight tear in my quad which is really painful um it wasn't that bad on saturday but then su yes like sunday monday it is very bad so i didn't train this morning <sighs> i'm gonna do some pilates when i get home i woke up with my alarm set in hopes that i would go to the 7 a.m it was just aching and i'm like i don't really know how much of my class i'll be able to do so i'm going to a cafe now to edit last week's vlog so i have no idea what the sound quality will be like in comparison to my um canon mic i hope that it's okay like literally haven't looked back at any of this footage the, the whole vlog could be an entire ways i know it won't be but i just really hate when you guys tell me the camera quality and the video quality is shit because i just don't want to waste my cameras I know I could sell them, but it just seems so wasteful. I don't know. Just trying to make do with what I've got. So, yeah, I'm on my way to Blackwood now to edit, but I'm also meeting... Oh, Steph. Good morning. Good morning, my darling girl. I'm meeting Steph. We're going to... We're doing... We've got, like, 10 days together in Europe. Some of it is Ibiza, and then we're doing Italy. Oh. Hello? Alright, this is going to test our friendship. Almond decaf latte, is that you? <laughs> or you oat? We have 10 days together in Ibiza. I mean, no, sorry. Not 10 days together. We have 10 days together in Europe, a few days in Ibiza, and then we're doing um, the Amalfi. So we are planning out where we're going from today. And then I'm going to stay, edit my vlog. I hope I have a better week this week. I just, I haven't felt like myself lately. My work ethic has been really low. Motivation has been really low. I haven't really been able to concentrate. To be honest, I think I'm having like a bit of a depressive episode. I'm just not feeling good. And I know I should see my psychologist, but I just feeling glum. I do this every time. I know I should stay seeing her when things are good because the second I feel low, she's the last person I want to see. I don't know why that is. Anyway. Now I've got a bloody try and find a park. I hate when I'm looking for a park and I make eye contact with someone and then they think that I must be looking at them or like checking them out and I'm like no no alright I will show you guys what we get for breakfast <laughs> Jesus Christ hi guys welcome back to my channel <laughs> today we're eating some breakfast <laughs> what'd you get? I got I don't know morning glory we got chorizo, extra avocado, goat's cheese, some scrambled eggs, and some bread. Oh, Happy days. I got a very sad hot cakes with my cinnamon free. Okay, I've just finished editing. I've just left the cafe. I'm dropping my bag back to my car. Um, I'm going to go for a quick... I'm just exhausted. I just don't feel very well. But I'm going to go for a quick walk because it's a beautiful day. I'm just going to go listen to some music. I might listen to a podcast or something. I don't know. I just feel like going for a walk, getting out into the sun, stretching my legs because I've been sitting down. I met Steph at nine and it's now 20 past one. So I've been sitting, working for a long time. So I want to stretch my legs, take a bit of a break. And then I think I have some more um, edit, uh, filming to do. So I'll do that when I get home. Oh! I don't know why I looked so red. Oh, well, I was just trying on um, some Princess Polly stuff. I didn't know why my face is so red, though. But I did a Pilates class tonight. I did Body by Burner at 5 o'clock. And then I've gotten home, had a shower, and now I'm eating 
some leftover shepherd's pie from last week and watching Criminal Minds. Good morning guys, happy Tuesday. It's just before nine, I'm on my way to the gym. I'm using this vlog or this, I guess this portion of the video to not let my bad mood ruin my day or potentially my week. I'm not feeling great mentally. I have a lot going on. I'm feeling very lost at the moment. I'm a bit confused. I don't know what I'm doing. Like I know I'm going to Europe and that's about the only thing that I know for certain that's going on. I'm just I'm stressed about family stuff and like I feel like I'm not doing my job well either. I just, I'm feeling very flat and very unaccomplished and I'm a bit disappointed in myself and I don't want to feel like this anymore. And so I'm going to turn my week around. It's Tuesday. I didn't have the best day yesterday. Even getting out of bed this morning was a real struggle, hence why I'm doing the 9am. It's not very good light. I'll, um, I'll talk to you guys after the gym. I should be the endorphins should have come out a bit by then so i should hopefully be feeling a bit better oh my god it looks so <laughs> get the shot we i remembered to get the chili oil on the side this time smell them these are the salted chocolate chip cookies from from blackwood they're so good i just put Sonte's tan on. It's a new tan that I'm trying out. This is the second time I've tried it. The color is beautiful. Um, I was just reading some of my book before my dinner came. I was going to cook burgers, but that's my dinner. I got laksa instead. Let's see how it is. Oh, oh sweet girl. It is so cold in my kitchen. So it comes in separate containers. The chicken and laksa is in this and then the veggies and noodles. I don't usually eat the whole thing and I always end up wasting heaps of it. So I'm gonna try and just do half and then if I'm still hungry, I can do more. Hmm, let's just do all the veg and I'll try and save the liquid if I can. I love laksa. Mmm. It's just so good. Oh my god, I look insane. Look at that. Delicious. Just gone to Circular Key. Oh, hey. There's Willy Boy. Man. Willy and I came to, I think we're at Bungalow 8. Had a drink. William is having a Negroni. <laughs> Says it's very good. I'm having an amaretto sour. And we're sitting opposite the bow. The bow is fucking huge. It's a big boat. <laughs> it's a big boat for a big boy. What was your inspiration for this show? So I think for this show, uh, I really wanted people to see the versatility of the shark flex style. I wanted people to see texture, I wanted people to see volume, I wanted people to see bend, different ages, um, so, um. One kiss and I open my eyes I go to the Crystal Car Wash in Rose Bay on New South Ed Road. Yum, so remember the other night how I got the Luxa takeaway? Well, I saved some of the sauce because otherwise I just don't eat it all and then I waste it. So I saved some of the, like the chicken and sauce because I wasn't going to eat it all. And then I just chopped up some carrot and 
cooked some soba noodles and this is freaking delicious. I mean, there's not many vegetables in this, but it's a very quick, easy and cheap lunch out of leftovers. It's delish. What were you doing that you should have been? <laughs> it's his birthday in three days and he's got all this attitude. Getting old. You look very red in this light. Yeah, I don't mind that. Oh, that's better. Oh, wait, I want to take a photo. Yep, go for it. Ooh, steamy boy. Mains. We got a lumoncini, tomato, chili, and garlic, I think. Broccolini. Willy Boy's birthday on Sun. What's wrong with you? Oh. <laughs> Just getting old. <laughs> Everyone guess how old Will's turning on Sunday. Yeah. <laughs> you only guess because you'll never know. It's rude to ask. Good morning, guys. Happy Friday. I am currently on my way to Erskineville. A bit random. Um, but I'm going on uh, Two Broke Chicks podcast, Sal and Al's, which is very exciting. Have I shown them on a vlog before i'm very good friends with them they're very near and dear to my heart beautiful girls uh and they've been trying to get me on their podcast for ages and we've finally been able to make it work so i don't know if it will be live by the time this video is live but if it is i will leave a link to it down below and once it does go live i'll add the link to the description box but be sure to check it out and i'll definitely link it on my instagram story once it goes live but yeah i'm doing that and then i drop will to the airport afterwards i go back to Rose Bay, pick him up and take him to the airport. And then we're being separated for 12 weeks or 11 weeks because the day he flies out of Rome to come back home, I land in Rome two hours before. So I guess I'll see him at the airport in Rome and then he comes home and then I start my holiday. <laughs> okay, I... I've done the podcast, um, I finished that a couple of hours ago, it went really well. It won't be live for another couple of weeks. If you're following me on Instagram, I'll have it linked in my on, on stories there. Um, and then I've just dropped Will off and I got a little bit emotional saying goodbye. I know I'll see him again soon. Like 11 weeks isn't a long time, but it's just a bit of childhood trauma. Mum leaving when I was young and then obviously losing my dad. I don't do well with goodbyes, no matter how long or short they're for. I just, I don't like knowing that someone I love dearly is leaving my life for an extended period. But it's fine. I think I'm also just a bit sad. I'm a bit annoyed at myself for not double checking his dates with my dates so that we could match, meet up. So I think if we're lucky, I'll get to see him in Rome airport just after I land before he takes off. But I don't know what the chances are. But it's fine. It's just a bit of a missed opportunity. Like we could have had Aperol's in Rome together even for just one night. <sighs> so I'm a bit annoyed at myself for that. But anyway, now I'm just on my way back and I'm popping into all Lara. I'm gonna go have some quick lunch with Kane. So I'm starving and then I need to go home and finish editing my Princess Polly hole. And I think there's something else I need to do. And then I need to bloody take my hair out because this hairstyle is fucking painful. And then I've got dinner at Blackwood tonight with the girls, with Soph, Trin, and Zoe. I don't think you guys have met Zoe yet. She's English. She's friends with the English boys, um, but she's just finished her farm work up north. She's finally back and she's moved in with Stace, which is really exciting. So catching up with her, I'm gonna go see her beforehand at Stace's house, like at their house, catch up with her, and then we'll meet the girls at Blackwood. And we're gonna go for happy hour. And it'll be lovely. <laughs>
Croatia. Hello, beautiful. <laughs> She almost just got hit by a tram because she tripped and almost fell in front of it. So that was... Not the outfit, not today. <laughs> it's fine, it's, it's not the worst. It's, it's definitely not the worst. 